while it might be a sort of modern secular society, I do think that there is a place and also a, a desire from some people to reconnect with that music, particularly of 15th to 17th centuries, which is as much as it, a historical artefact as it is a kind of living piece of music and part of the sacred tradition here. It's amazing to be able to keep bringing that back to life and find new things uh, with that music. And I think the way that we program with putting sacred music uh, alongside either secular pieces or contemporary pieces, it gives it a lot of perspective and therefore people, I think, whatever their personal faith is or isn't, they are able to connect with the music at their level. It's an interesting problem to have, but we, we try and approach it from both a kind of academic and also just a purely musical sort of audience listening perspective as well. What, what do we think people want to hear uh, and can we present that to them in a way that they'd like to then hear it again?